Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Uh, Mr. Chairman, in addition to the Republican plan that breaks the promise of Medicare and ends Medicare as we know it, the Republicans uh, also propose to raise the cost of prescription drugs and slash the smart new benefits and popular consumer reforms that have been in place uh, for two years now and are working very well. This is a real double whammy uh, for our older neighbors all across America. Uh, so here's what my amendment does. It proposes to retain the closing of the donut hole and, what, and the money that's going back into the pockets of our older neighbors, parents and grandparents, proposes to retain those important new screenings, uh, the mammograms and co colonoscopies that are saving lives, and it proposes to retain that important new wellness visit that has become very popular and actually is, is very smart policy. So first, on the, on the donut hole, uh, under the Affordable Care Act that has been in place for two years, mm -hmm. uh, what is currently happening is that cliff that many of our older neighbors were falling off of when it came to paying for their prescription drugs is now closing. Uh, right now, uh, seniors are getting 50% discounts on brand name drugs uh, under Medicare Part D. That donut hole will be completely closed by 2020. And it has already helped over three and a half million seniors with high drug costs. On average, uh, it saved uh, the average uh, Medicare beneficiary over $600. Uh, in my di Florida district alone, over 6,000 seniors in my district have received prescription drug discounts. And it is predicted that uh, through 2021, this will save our older neighbors $2,400. And our parents and grandparents will no ha longer have to struggle with uh, the, those very expensive prescription drugs. Unfortunately, in the Republican budget, Republicans propose to put these costs back on uh, our seniors with high drug costs and, and have them make very difficult choices. Uh, secondly, the Affordable Care Act also right now has provided an estimated 32.5 million seniors and disabled individuals with a preventative screening, such as a mammogram or colonoscopy. Because of the Affordable Care Act in my Florida district, over 70,000 of my older neighbors have received this preventative uh, screening without an additional co-payment that oftentimes kept them out of the doctor's office. Uh, the Republican budget, unfortunately, will increase the cost. They will now have to go back and pay uh, additional co-payments if they want to, to go in for those screenings. And finally, one of the most popular reforms under the Affordable Care Act has been the new wellness visit. They get one annual wellness visit. Uh, in 2011, 2.3 million seniors in traditional Medicare took advantage of this new benefit. Uh, through the Republican budget and repeal, it would take away this important tool uh, that patients and their doctors uh, realize is really saving lives. It is smart policy and the Republican budget shouldn't break the promise of Medicare and they shouldn't roll back these important reforms that are making a difference in the lives of our older neighbors. 